As I believe you know, it is a tradition for the father of the bride to dance with the bride. Our family has a couple of other traditions, however. We will, the father will dance with the bride. However, in our family, the favorite dance with her mother was the twist. We then learned the twist and actually Rita and I, when we were younger, competed in twist contest. But you know, we learned the twist from the master. A gentleman by the name of Ernest Evans. And he, through the auspices of Portland Communications and my good friend Gil McKinney and Michael Libby, have arranged for Ernest Evans to come and teach my daughter how to do the twist. <laughs> now, most of you probably don't automatically recognize the name Ernest Evans. You would recognize him as Chubby Chucko. <laughs>
gonna be a great night tonight, everybody. You ain't seen nothing yet. We're gonna take it back to the Tina Turner days. Taking you back, everybody. Back to the days of Tina Turner. Thank you, Mark. Stay tuned. We've got more coming up. You don't want to miss this. We'll show you how a wedding reception in Des Moines ended with an unexpected twist. It was a surprise ending to a very happy day for a couple of Des Moines newlyweds. Patrick and Ann Kelly were married today and followed with a reception at the Wakanda Club. When it was time for the ceremonial father-daughter dance, it took an exciting twist. Get it? The bride and her father had planned to dance to the Chubby Checker hit, The Twist, but it wouldn't be the same without <laughs> Chubby Checker. Yes, that is him performing the wow. classic song to a very surprised bride. want to be at that wedding. Oh, that's great. That How like awesome. Oh, wow. I have a sneaking suspicion you'll see more of that tomorrow night on our late show, so tune in <laughs> then. Thanks for watching. Have a great night. <laughs>
coming up in just a couple weeks. It wasn't the monkey or the swim that had him sweating to the oldies here at the Wakanda Club on Saturday night. See why it was a guy by the name of Ernest Evans and a little thing he calls the twist. <laughs> You're watching KCCI News Channel 8 at 10. Iowa's news leader with Kevin Cooney, Jeanette Trumpeter, Heidi Soliday Sports, and meteorologist John McLaughlin with exclusive live Super Doppler weather. This is KCCI News Channel 8. I made up my mind probably two months ago that this was going to be the dance. Over the years, a dad's relationship with his daughter tends to take tons of twists and turns. You know how it is with dads and daughters. One minute, she has dad twisted around her little finger. Yeah, and the next, he's twisting arms to get her out of trouble. <laughs> but as we see in tonight's Carlin Covers Central Iowa, we will meet a father who put a new twist on the traditional father-daughter dance at his daughter's weekend wedding reception. Anne-Marie and Patrick Kelly had a beautiful wedding in Des Moines on Saturday. But when they sealed it with a kiss, they had no idea what Anne Marie's father, a guy who loves surprises, had in store for them at the reception. If we're going to do a father daughter dance, this would be the traditional Schneider father daughter dance. Fred and wife Rita Schneider love the 1960 classic, The Twist, and doing the dance has become a family tradition. But you never learn the twist from the master. A gentleman by the name of Ernest Evans. I have arranged for Ernest Evans to come and teach my daughter how to do the twist. So thanks to a favor from friends and in a twist of faith, Ernest Evans, a.k.a. Chubby Checker, waltzed into the Wakanda Club and got down. Was it worth it? Well, for the answer to that, all Schneider had to do was check out the dance floor after Chubby Checker checked in. Come on, Guests from all over the country gladly grooved to the rock and roll legend. He sounded so good. That I mean, it was better than a CD. And at 63, Chubby is still more than capable of twisting the night away. Weddings are difficult for dads who are giving away their daughters. But Saturday, Fred Schneider proved that by focusing on the happiness of others, he could provide his little girl and her new husband with a gift that keeps on giving. That's exactly the reason, to give them something to remember. Steve Carlin, KCCI, News Channel 8. So cool. Yeah, looks like Fred and Rita had those moves down, too. <laughs> Who knew? We were told that the surprise was so top secret, not even the bride's mother, Rita, knew about the special guest until he walked through the doors. Way that to go. Me. One minute, she has Dad twisted around her little finger. The next, she's twi he's twisting arms to get her out of trouble. But in this morning's Carlin Cover Central Iowa, we meet a father who used a twist of fate to make sure his daughter could dance the twist with the twist master at her weekend wedding reception. Here's Steve Carlin. To have and to hold. Anne Marie and Patrick Kelly had a beautiful wedding in Des Moines on Saturday. <laughs> but when they sealed it with a kiss, they had no idea what Anne Marie's father, a guy who loves surprises, had in store for them at the reception. If we're going to do a father-daughter dance, this would be the traditional Schneider father-daughter dance. Fred and wife Rita Schneider love the 1960 classic, The Twist, and doing the dance has become a family tradition. But you never learn the twist from the master. A gentleman by the name of Ernest Evans. I have arranged for Ernest Evans to come and teach my daughter how to do the twist. So thanks to a favor from friends and in a twist of faith, Ernest Evans... 
aka Chubby Checker, waltzed into the Wakanda Club and got down. Was it worth it? Well, for the answer to that, all Schneider had to do was check out the dance floor after Chubby Checker checked in. Guests from all over the country gladly grooved to the rock and roll legend. He sounded so good. I mean, it was better than a CD. And at 63, Chubby is still more than capable of twisting the night away. Weddings are difficult for dads who are giving away their daughters. But Saturday, Fred Schneider proved that by focusing on the happiness of others, he could provide his little girl and her new husband with a gift that keeps on giving. That's exactly the reason, to give them something to remember. Steve Carlin, KCCI, News Channel 8. What a wedding. Now we're told the surprise was so top secret, not even the bride's mother knew about the special guest until he arrived.